Hey guys, in this video we're going through the Buckingham Pie procedure in a real example. So hopefully this will clarify any problems you had with the conceptual video. So onto our example. For an open channel flow down a slope, the flow rate depends on, here's our variables, length, area, roughness, slope, density, dynamic viscosity and gravity. Find the functional form for the flow rate. So our function is going to be represented by flow rate is dependent on a function of length, area, roughness, slope, gravity, rho, mu. Going back to our procedure, our first step is to determine relevant variables. Since it was given in the question, we can skip that. We know all our variables. We know the form of our function is that there. So next we determine each variable's dimensions using the MLT system. That's step two. So we've done step one. Is that one there? Step two, we're going to find all the dimensions of these variables. So Dimensions of Q, remember the square brackets mean dimensions of, that should be a Q. Uh, now I like to write down, or it helps to write down the units first, so I'll just do that over here, m cubed per second, so that's meters uh, is a length, length cubed per second time. Going on to length equal to L obviously that's meters area that's meters squared so that's length squared roughness is millimeters or meters so that's going to be a length slope has no dimensions um, because it's a comparison it's it's the angle at which uh, the slope is sitting, so that's going to be 1, or M0, L0, T0. Gravity is meters per second squared, which is L to the 1, T to the minus 2. 